Hello there my friends and today I'm here to share with you my winter favorites. Most of these things are actually gifts I got for Christmas but it's pretty easy to explain. My family got access to my Amazon wishlist last year. They gave me everything I actually needed or wanted. But there are also things that I purchased myself and there is a lot of things so let's just get started. Actually, I will start with telling you about my favorite place in winter. It was actually a small town up north, which is called Tofti. We went there at the end of February to have sort of romantic getaway. It was very nice, it was a little condo by the lake, it was very peaceful and I really miss waking up to the sound of waves. I have this small tradition every year to go and buy myself new pajamas before Christmas, but last year I decided to equip myself with a whole cozy outfit that I can use to snuggle by the fireplace. And I actually got it from American Eagle Outfitters, their winter collection was perfect for that. Sorry, the items are not in the perfect condition anymore, I wore them basically every day during winter. The main thing in this outfit was this beautiful cozy cardigan, it's very long and warm, it actually has alpaca wool in it. It was a perfect match with these sweater leggings, this long soft and sexy t-shirt which is so light and comfortable that you basically feel naked. And of course these fuzzy socks. I was also pretty obsessed with these puffy slippers from Ikea that I wore all the time with my brown cozy outfit. Aren't they just amazing? They're so comfy, so pretty and they're very unique and everybody was always asking me where I got them from. I also had a pretty stable outfit for outdoors. It is just so perfect that I didn't want to wear anything else. I already mentioned this quote to you before, but I never really talked about it a lot. This is my quote from Zara. It's kind of hard to show, but I hope you will see. I don't usually buy anything in Zara, but their quotes are so amazing that I can't resist. I just love their designs. They're perfect for my style. I actually had another quote just like this, but in different color variations that I purchased two or three years ago from eBay and I was wearing it constantly during these years and I was really upset that I can't find anything just like that code. And I was really fortunate to be browsing Zara website on Black Friday and I saw that they had this code basically like my old one with a 50% discount and I'm really happy I found it. I also got this cute beanie by French Connection also on a Black Friday. I think it fits my code pretty well. It's very comfortable and warm. I really really like it. I paired it with this cute mittens from Accessorize. Sometimes instead of that beanie I wear my River Island Barrette. It's 100% wool, it's beautiful beige color with black leather rim and pom-pom. You might have seen me wearing it in my other video already. You also might have seen me wearing my new glasses that I actually got from Bon Look. I really like them, these are my first glasses from this website and I wanted to order something from them for such a long time. I'm not sure if this shape is perfect for me really, but I really like the pattern so I couldn't resist. I have a prescription if you're wondering. The model is actually called Trail Blazer and the color is called Woodland Plate. If you want to order yourself high quality glasses, I would really recommend check out their website. It's not sponsored, I did not get this for free, but they're really good. This winter I was mostly using my thrifted bags that I showed you in my thrift favorites, but I was also replacing them with my adorable backpack sometimes. And this is this kitty backpack that I got off Amazon and was around $25 I think. It's very comfortable, it's pretty durable too, even though it's not a real leather. It's just so cute. And I also put a keychain from Target on it, and I think they look really good together. The last accessory I was loving this winter are actually beautiful earrings that I got from my mother's in law husband. <laughs> he is a jeweler, and I always wanted to get something from his work. He was really kind to give me these earrings for Christmas. They're so unique, they're handmade. I'm sure nobody else has anything like that, they are very special for me. I'm not going to show you a lot of beauty items in this video because I want to make a separated current beauty favorites type of video. I also will show you a couple of things here. First one is this set. Yes, I know I haven't used it yet. I decided to include it in my favorites because I really like the design of this and I also really like the smells of these scrubs. It's actually a gift from my mother-in-law and it was a surprise for me. Scrubs from Trader Joe's and the first one is called Fuji Apple. The 
second one Tahiti and Paradise, the third one Fresh Fruit. I can't wait to use them. The other beauty thing is actually technically a gift from her too. She just gave me cash. I used it to get this perfume which is called Tender Romance by Ralph Lauren. I'm in love with this scent. I wanted to get this perfume for a long time and I was really excited when I was finally able to do that. It's very florally scent. As far as I know it has magnolia and cashmere notes in it. It's beautiful, it's very rich, it smells expensive but it's not overwhelming and it lasts for a long time. I was also very lucky to finally get a whole set of makeup brushes from my mother on Christmas. I actually chose them myself. They're so amazing. The brand is called La Ferra. They come in this beautiful purse, which is actually real leather. Brushes themselves are gorgeous. They have these wooden handles. I just feel so grateful and almost professional every time I get to use this set. I also couldn't miss Christmas collection in Lush last year, and I got myself this adorable polar bear. I haven't tried all the products from here yet yet but all the scents are my favorites they're basically like vanilla honey sweet scents i've tried already honey bee bath bomb and i've tried reindeer and robin fun reindeer and robin fun was a really interesting thing basically it looks like a play-doh you can make different figures with it i think i didn't do it right i started playing with it when it was already wet but it was kind of dissolving in my hands which wasn't perfect and it was just like staining everything. If you want to play with this kind of thing, you need to play with it while it's dry, then you wet it and use it as something for your body. Also, I had my favorite set of shower gel and lotion and I got it from Bath & Body Works. I'm pretty sure it's called Champagne Toast. I actually had a candle just like that a year before and I'm pretty sure it was in my old video with my favorites. The smell is just so pleasant. It's champagne-y but it's also really fruity. It was perfect for New Year festive smell. I also had a couple of favorite books this winter and I got them from my mother as well. They're both by Bobby Brown. The first one is called Everything Eyes. It has a lot of good information if you want to learn how to put makeup on your eyes. I like that it has a period section for people with glasses. It teaches you how to define your eyes so they stay bright and beautiful anyway. I haven't read it completely, but this type of books I feel like you don't just start in the beginning and go to the end. You kind of open it in a random spot, learn something new and then come back to it. This one is makeup manual, more general. I really like that it also tells you how to take care of your skin. Taking care of my skin is even more important for me. Which cream, which serum, which toner you should use, in which order and all of that stuff. I kind of try to learn these things from YouTube. This book will tell me more of the stuff that I need to know. I got this amazing vinyl from my husband. He knows how much I love Placebo. This is the album that we started listening to together when I was still living in Moscow. It's called Sleeping with Ghosts. Our favorite song from here is Protect Me From What I Want. This vinyl is very beautiful. It has pictures of them. Here are the lyrics of all the songs. And the actual vinyl is bright blue color, which I always think is so cool. I was also obsessively listening to a new album of my favorite favorite Russian band, which is called Lumen. I don't know if anybody is interested in that, but I can leave a link in the description. I don't really have anything specific that I liked from food. We had a lot of good recipes that we tried out this winter. There are so many that I can't choose just one. just decided to show you my favorite winter tea. This white Christmas tea by Harney and Sons, which I got in Barnes & Noble. It's white tea with almonds and vanilla. It's really interesting and unique flavor. I've never tried anything like this before. It was perfect for warm and cozy winter nights. There was also a lot of things that I liked around the house. The first one is essential oils diffuser. It's such an amazing thing to have. I love using essential oils, especially if I'm doing yoga. I use a lemon essential oil to kind of feel more energy. Sometimes I use lavender oil to feel more relaxed. Essential oil diffuser is perfect because it makes very subtle light scent and it lasts for hours. Small 
cup of warm water and basically two drops of essential oil this lasts for five hours in a light setting it might even last eight or ten hours it lights up and it can change brightness of the light i was really excited about this gift the other thing he got me was actually a new planner for 2017 this one from paper source it's so gigantic <laughs> i love that it comes with a box this way i can make it look decent as long as possible it's basically a light pink gray and gold marble very stylish i am obsessed with this design the pages are completely gold on the edges it basically has a page for every single day of the year other than weekends weekends are paired on the page it takes me a while to fill it out i'm actually way way behind it's a really nice size for putting pictures inside and photos basically put whatever my heart desires i also got some gifts for my kitchen because people know how much i love cooking my husband gave me this adorable bear pose oven mitts they're really convenient these silicon spots make it pretty much impossible for you to burn yourself i feel incredibly happy every time i'm cooking something and using them i'm also feeling incredibly happy using a gift from my sister-in-law this amazing apron with cupcakes on it it's so beautiful it has this pocket with a ribbon even though i was using it already i still have a tag on brand is called jesse steel if you want to find a cute apron for yourself or somebody else you can check it out she also got me the oven meat for this apron as always i was completely obsessed with candles this winter i think it's perfect season for candles my favorite ones were this couple candles from bath and body works the first one is called chocolate pistachio and i am completely in love with this scent it's sweet it doesn't make you just sick from sweetness every time i burn it my husband says that our house smells like brownies other one is called hot cocoa and cream i haven't really used it that much i think i used it just a couple times but I really love this scent as well. I really love the package of this one. It's beautiful matte brown glass. Okay, and the last thing I was completely obsessed this winter is actually my new phone. It is iPhone 6 Plus. I got it from my husband on Christmas. I was actually surprised that he got me this big one. It felt really weird to use this big screen for a while, but now I would not be able to go back to smaller screen. I was actually able to finally upgrade quality of my Instagram photos. It's also a gold color and I really wanted a gold iPhone. I already equipped it with a perfect case and a perfect protecting glass. The case is actually pretty fancy. It is by Michael Kors. I got it on a huge discount, basically for $30. And $30 is a price people charge for a regular plastic cases nowadays. It has this paisley pattern. It's a real leather. It has gold letters Michael Kors on the bottom. Sides are nice and matte, so it's really easy to hold it. These were all the things that I was really enjoying in winter. I haven't included any shows on movies in here, but I will probably leave a couple of them in the description. I just didn't want to make this video too long. I hope you liked this video, and if you did, don't forget to put likes, click subscribe button, and leave me comments down below. Thank you so very much for watching. Watching. I feel great after talking to you. Bye!